This is a homecoming for 12-year-old Alexandra, back to the Kirkwood Academy where she honed her ballet fundamentals. Uh, she has a quality that uh, you can't make, it's just there. The work she put in on this floor opened the door to Canada's National Ballet School in Toronto. I see my parents almost every two months or every month, so it's not as big as I thought it was going to be, but it still is pretty big. Just a few days ago, she received the biggest news of her young life. After dance class one day, I heard that the Nutcracker postings were up. And the phone rang, and it was a Toronto phone number, so I answered the phone. And then I came back out, and everybody was surrounding it. And all there was was sobbing on the other side of the phone. They're like, oh my gosh, you got the part, you got the part. And I'm like, oh my god, and then <laughs> I got the role. It's a big deal for me. and. I'm proud of myself. She will dance the lead role in the National Ballet of Canada's Nutcracker, a rare honor. She has that, that wonderful combination of still a very childlike innocence and yet a maturity that you really need to have, as you say, to handle this role. She has a lot more work to do, but at 12 years old, she is already so close to making some of her deepest dreams come true. She truly is an amazing kid. And we're joined in studio now by Alexandra and several of her dancing friends. And also we have Cheryl here from Save on Foods in the Woodgrove location. Congra congratulations, Alexandra. It's very nice to meet you and your whole group of people here. They're all very proud of you and so are we. Congratulations. And we think that you probably know an amazing t kid or two that's out there and we'd like to hear from them, from you. And uh, here's the contact information to uh, give your nomination.